What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Bob Dragon here. You call me Dragon on today. We're back at the game with some more Hogwarts Legacies. We're back at the game with some more Hogwarts Legacies. We are to you where we left off. I'm actually moving a little bit. We are literally outside of our next quest. Look, 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 look at my mans, bro. Look, look at them, bro. Rippy with the trench coat. We, we need to change that little, the, um, the middle piece. But everything else is fine. But yeah, right now we gotta go to potion class because that is technically what we're supposed to be doing. Um, we're gonna try and do this, but it's dodging attacks. Like we gotta do four more dodges. I'm so used to like blocking and countering, so I gotta we gotta do finish that so we can keep it pushing. But yeah, potion class. And don't mind me, I'm sitting here, you know me, I mean, eating my gummy bears, you know? Right. The man got a look. Hip walk. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might you, right? come in handy? That's yes, Professor potion. Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a wig and weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. That, that's all you give me, bro? Oh, okay. I just gotta read and do it. Okay. I feel like Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please like be meticulous this. when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I feel like this. Just give me a, like... We're actually being a student. It's not just, you know, oh, you know, we're a wizard. We actually have responsibilities as a student. We gotta keep up with. What are you creating? I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. Well, thank you. Thank and from what much. I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Oh, yeah. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Yeah. Yes, but why does that matter to you? That Brilliant! Was... And it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy no. with potions, if I do say so myself. No. Pleasure to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single fupa feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me.
I don't know, Gareth. I don't want to get on Sharp's bad yeah, side. Like you won't. Fooper feathers aren't that valuable. Sharp won't even miss it. Okay. Very well. I'll bring you a Fooper feather. Brilliant! Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Remember, precision. That's not rare, bro. Okay. Potion stations organized and free of clutter. Here's the flopper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Endurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Yeah, mine's over here. The no. Dibney or crush it. This is my brewing the Wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! What do you do? What? Oh, Dragon duck. What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. Gonna add better death. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. You're part of Gryffindor, okay. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. Oh. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I knew it would give me in trouble. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learnt a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was sceptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. Oh. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Hmm. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Okay. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. I heard him talking about taking responsibility. Professor Sharp wasn't happy. Leave me out of your grand plans next time. Sorry to hear that. Hopefully he's already forgotten about it. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. Okay. A portrait in our common room wants to talk to you. It's Eldritch Diggory. He used to be the Minister for Magic, I think. A portrait? Ugh, my in robes are going in. to reap from Gareth's okay. inspiration for the rest of term. Prisoner of Love. I gotta go to the common room, right? Yep. Portrait. 
Wish I could sneak into the other common rooms. Just for an hour or so. I adore spending sunny afternoons in the viaduct courtyard. Wonderful place to practice Accio. On other students' foot. Oh yeah. Hell yeah, okay. All right. You wanted to see me, sir? Indeed. Allow me to introduce myself. So few students know who I am these days. Heldridge Diggory, former Minister for Magic and founder of the Aura Recruitment Program at your service. I believe you can help solve a decades-old murder thanks to that book you found and, in particular, its missing pages. Oh. How do you know about the book and the pages? We portraits here more than you might suspect, and most of us can keep a secret. So, what say you? Surely a Hufflepuff such as yourself would be inclined to help seek long overdue justice. This could be right up my street. Even we Hufflepuffs enjoy a good mystery. Glad to hear you are up to the challenge. Oh, yeah. Plus, I believe you'll benefit from this undertaking. My great niece, Helen Thistlewood, can provide you with details. She's retired now, but was a skilled aura in her day. And the unsolved murder of which I speak was her case. I often visit my portrait in her home, in the nearby hamlet of Upper Hogsfield. Shall I tell her to expect you? Yeah. I shall go and see her right no away. Questions. Brilliant. With what I suspect is your knack for hard work and her keen mind, both mysteries may be solved sooner than you think. I shall see you there soon, I hope. Oh my god, okay. Open up, thank you. Let's see how close we can get by fast traveling, because this world map. Okay, it's this way. God, okay, Hogsmeade. Where's Hogsmeade? I gotta cut through Hogsmeade, so I guess we'll. Teleport there. I really wish they would just give me my, <coughs> my flying um Griffin or Let's meet here something. I come. Alright, um Alright, gotta get the Yeah. Accio! I'm here. Yeah. The thing is, like, with this game, like, this is actually, like, helping me, like, you know, be better at pressing the numbers. I usually don't press, like, the numbers on my keyboard. So, wait, actually, let me see something. Okay, no. It's only the top numbers. Oh, God. Okay, that's fine. I usually don't, yeah, I usually don't press the top numbers, like, above the keyboard. I usually press, like, the ones on the right-hand side. What the hell is that? Nah, fuck this quest. What is that? Oi, pass that fire whiskey over here. <laughs> you have to. <laughs> what did you get turned into, buddy? What? Okay, okay. okay. Bop, 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 bop. Uh, I won't rest until you're so. dead. Oh, oh, God. Okay, 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 okay. What's up with it? Bop. Weave. Bop. Weave. Yes. Boom. That's all I needed. <gasps> Goodbye. Ranrock has fooled you all. Do your demise. They were here. What's the Revelio? In the thing. Nothing. Okay, fine. Um, 
because we just keep going after those. Look at that, G. I'll let you cut, G. Okay, we're getting closer. Oh yeah, that's right, pretty much like almost here. What if her quest to take out those two guys there? This must be the place Minister Diggory mentioned. Helen oh. lives around here somewhere. Bard of Beaumont should have returned by now. Had by dark wizards he was. Excuse me, did you say something about Bard of Beaumont? I did. I don't think we've met. I'm Dorothy Sprottle. I was just worrying about Claire Beaumont's brother, Bardolf. Only he's gone missing. Rumor is he was seen in the forest practicing dark magic. Saw him myself near some ruins with Rookwood's lot I did. Oh, God. I fear he got himself into trouble with the Ashwinders, especially if he made them a promise he couldn't keep. I'd help search for him myself, but no one will risk encountering Ranrock's loyalists. They seem to be everywhere. I got you. I can certainly look out for him. Any help would be appreciated. You might speak to Claire first. Perhaps she has some insights that I don't. I can tell you that Bardolf was last seen in the forest wearing a particular woolen jumper. One that Claire knitted herself. Okay. Claire will be at her shop if you'd like to speak with her. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to continue with our quest, though. Oh, it already switched my quest. I don't know when it does that. I mean, I can check this real quick. Alright, um, we're going to quest. This one. Oh, right here? Okay. Ah, here you are. I'm pleased to see you took my advice. Okay, what do you want? Madam Thistlewood, I met your great uncle in his portrait in my common room. He sent me to speak to you. I'm pleased you came. Uncle Eldritch believes the book you found and its missing pages may be relevant to an unsolved case from my time as an aura. Very well. I'm listening. Decades ago, a student named Richard Jackdaw disappeared after going to meet a girl named Anne. They never found his body. When his headless ghost appeared briefly in Hogsmeade, wholly unaware of how he died, Anne was convicted of his murder and sent to Azkaban. It was in large part due to the testimony of a girl called Apollonia Black. Jealous of Anne, I think. That sounds terrible, but I'm not sure how I can help. Anne's alibi was somewhat labyrinthine. She said Jackdaw promised her adventure following a map he found on some pages he'd stolen from Peeves. And you think Peeves ripped those pages from the book I found in the restricted section? If my great uncle is to be believed, yes. At least, that's what the portraits at Hogwarts suspect. Anne insisted that Jackdaw had asked her to follow the map with him, but only after she solved a series of puzzles he'd prepared. Odd way to woo a girl. She swears she never even solved the first puzzle, so they didn't meet. Jackdaw's ghost vanished almost as soon as he appeared. Without Jackdaw's puzzle, pages, or remains, Anne was sent to Azkaban based solely on Apollonia's spurious testimony. I don't understand. What can I do yeah, to help? I... I believe Anne may have solved the first puzzle by now, but after spending time in Azkaban, she's a shadow of her former self. She won't speak to anyone she doesn't trust, and she trusts no one. If you... A student with a connection to the pages, like Jackdaw had, spoke to Anne. She might reveal new information. Okay. What a horrible story. If you think I can help, I'll come with you. This is wonderful news. You are to be commended for your kindness and bravery. Fortunately, being a retired aura has its benefits. We can apparate right to her. I've escorted ministers, professors, and many others to that blasted place. Never a student, I'll admit, 
but I will keep you safe. Oh, Very well. Let's go. Steady yourself. We'll apparate together. Don't worry. I've never splinched anyone. Do take care now, and tread lightly in that horrible place. We'll be there in but a moment. That's cool. I don't care what no one says. That's cool. Just teleporting like that, bro? You can't beat that. Am I throwing up? Really? <laughs> My dude's weak and needed right now. What the fuck? I can't touch it. No. Expecto oh. Patronum! That's something Harry Potter said one time. What, what, that ought to keep that? them at bay for now. Though, be aware, you may feel a wave of despair. It will pass. Thank you for the warning. This really is a dismal place, but we'll be out of here soon enough. Now follow me. All right, come on. The Dementals won't harm us now. Still, be careful. I never thought I'd see the inside of Azkaban for myself. Nasty Dementals. Not even I could convince the Ministry to send them off. There's no need for such yeah, monsters. I'd cast Crucio and the lot of you! Yes. Ah, I was, I was clicking my mouse button, by the way. You don't scare me, young cur. May teach you some little of what you should know of. That witch you're with has a dark cloud over her. I can feel it. What is that I hear? Perhaps death. In all its mercy, oh, approaches. No one at school's going to believe this. Now remember, Anne has been here a long time. The Dementors aren't kind. Have patience and speak to her quietly and respectfully. Are you Anne? Who's there? Who speaks to me? I see, bro. Is that death? Finally come for me. I'm a student from Hogwarts. I found the book that you said would exonerate you. Ah, the book, the book. No one would look. None of the mages found the pages. Ooh, bars. Me thinks the feckless knave meandered to his cave. My fate was surely sealed in Upper Hockey Field. Bars. What are you trying to say? That the missing pages are in a cave near Upper Hogsfield? Hogs, hogs, field, field, ruins house, a vault concealed. A vault in some ruins near Upper Hogsfield. I suppose it can't hurt to look. Can't hurt to look, can't hurt to look. Go find the pages from your book. Helen, Helen, now you're here. Come in closer, be a dear. What is it, Anne? You're safe now. You have what you need. I'll be all right once I get... I don't think she's but Madam okay. Thistlewood, I... All right. I'll find it. I'll find Jack Daw's cave. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Not to, uh, so like she might be dead, homie. Hope you know that. How do you know? Could be dead.
And first, we're gonna do this. Upper Hogsfield is being terrorized by Ranrock's loyalists. It's not right. Madame Beaumont, might I speak with you? Yes. What about? Mrs. Sprottle told me a little about your brother's disappearance. Oh, dear Dorothy. She'd go looking for Bardolph herself if she could. She mentioned dark magic in even the Ashwinders. Despite my repeated warnings, Bardolph's been experimenting with dark magic near the edge of the forest. I thought perhaps he'd get it out of his system and it would gradually stop. But then one day, he didn't come home. I think I'm gonna go do home. this, because I want to get dark magic too. I'll let you know if I see or hear anything about him. Thank you. How kind. I'd be so grateful to learn where he is. I know in my heart he's out there. Do be careful. Actually. What do you have for sale? Bardolph, where are you? I'll not give up hope. Thank you for passing through. Excuse me, Mrs. Sprottle. Any news on Bardolph Beaumont's disappearance? Afraid not. I've spoken with Claire. Still worried sick about her brother. He was last seen heading towards the forest with one of Victor Rookwood's lot. Okay. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Let's do a sand spell out of bridge. This looks intriguing. Rebellion. Alright. Wait, what's going on over here? Alright. Stuff with fire shelters and one of the other attacks. Oh! Oh, okay. Incendium! You guys are pretty fun. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna. Let me listen. Incendium. 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 Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We're not going down there. Okay. Um. Okay. We got to. Incendium. What the? Levioso. Incendium. Accio. Incendium. Levioso. Revelio. Let me do that. Okay. Okay. We can't even get into that. Oh. Oh. Okay. 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 <laughs> Why you got? I need mean, you could tell I should me investigate. You can investigate what? Oh, that. Revelio. Uh, 
behind here. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Mm. This must be the place Anne told me about. No one's been here for ages. Revelio. Incendio. Outwit me, Jackdaw. Okay. Now, where's the clue you left behind? Revelio. All right. Well done. You solved my puzzle. I knew you were from your spirit, and the only one with whom I can trust. I should adventure. We at the edge of a forbidden forest. Okay. P.S. I tell you that I found this as I would have gone on alone if it did not. I will found that be. No, from Jackdaw. Anne never found it. So how did he die? Is she to blame at all? No. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. I got like a little chisel and said that and I'm scared of most of Could it be? Has someone solved my puzzle after all these years? Well done indeed. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw? I heard you disappeared years ago. You have some explaining to do. I do? That was my puzzle you solved. What are you doing here? A retired aura, Helen Thistlewood, told me about a map you stole from Peeves. And then Anne told me about a cave. You saw Anne? Broke my heart. I had to go on without her. Probably best of her in the end. Dare I ask? How is she? She was imprisoned in Azkaban for your murder. I fear the Dementors have taken an irreversible toll on her. What? Azkaban? Oh, poor Anne. I had no idea. I thought she'd written me off. I've been travelling the world for years to mend my broken heart. I came back here only recently. On a whim. I must speak to the aura you mentioned and see how I can help Anne. I'm glad to hear it. Before you go, would I still be able to find the pages with the map Helen mentioned? I'm almost certain I dropped them in the cave the moment I was beheaded. They're bound to be mouldering away with the rest of me. Tell you what, meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you precisely where to find them. Eh. Thank you. I, I need to I find the pages I to it help a friend. I shall see you there. Can I ask you? Can I, can I talk to you again? Nope, okay, he's fine. Okay. Who lived here, I wonder? Yo, my dude just. Ooh, me with him. Look at look at this. Alright. Okay, we have a couple quests we gotta do. Suggested level 17. Okay, yeah, we're not ready for that. Mm. 
Let me get a save and go back to Hogwarts, okay? Wait, no. Oh, map then? I need to learn the disarming charm before I can follow which is good for us. Okay, so I need to keep I need to keep doing my studies. So. Oh during the day. It's night time, okay. Right, I know what I gotta do. So we're gonna map. We're gonna go to our Hogwarts, the Great Hall, common room. And we're gonna sleep. We're gonna sleep, but or but let's fast travel. It might just make it daytime. Is it day? I don't know how to tell if it's day or not. Look at that apple. Actually. Oh, which was my room. Oh, my I think it's over here. I don't know which one's my room. Maybe this one. Yep, this was mine. Go to class. I thought we could sleep, but I guess not. How far is it actually? Uh, we could fast travel. No, actually, running is good for the lungs. What are you kidding me? Oh, okay. It's me, Gareth. If you have a moment. Oh, oh, you were. Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing, wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. <laughs> you and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing Wisbys is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Of course. You never know when you might need a quick means of escape from the castle. Brilliant, thank you. But you should know that it's not exactly quick. It's the secret bit that's helpful. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. Couldn't you have someone buy the dried billywigs things? They're not for sale, and you never know when the cellar's going to be locked. So. The reliable way in and out is through the secret entrance. Uh, I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. Hmm. I'll need to get those dried billywigs things for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. I'm gonna do that now, actually. We're gonna see where this leads. A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. This Third. looks like the right statue. Oh. Now, what was the password? Descendium. Goodness. Who knew this was all down here? A lift. Must 
be how I get down. Looks broken though. Oh, repair. I'm gonna throw you little guy, I'm sorry. <laughs> Your life was short, okay. No, right, wrong, wrong things. It's this, right? I'll put you with that right now. Repair roll. I need to fix the lift before I can use it. Uh -huh. That seems to have done the trick. Bro, what? That's so handy, bro. You can't beat that. You really can't beat that. This castle will never cease to surprise me. Yeah, that stuff's my own thing where to get. Unless like we're like in a place like this, so yeah, we're gonna grab that. Yeah, what are these with like Skyrim and like this? You can just combine ingredients and you can see what happens. You could do that in Skyrim. Not if that's this. Incendium. I'm trapped. How am I supposed to get out of here? I'm scared. What's it again? If I could lift this platform, I think I could get it to work. I'm so sorry, man. This is a little spooky, I'm a little worried. It's set. If you back up here, okay. Back here. I don't do it by accident. I'm so used to um, that. This is the one we need. Let me answer. I'm going to have to get past this. I keep wasting them, bro. Okay, okay. I don't think we need you right now. So we're gonna do that. That. Let me also. It looks a bit broken. Perhaps I can try. Um, I meant to do That scared me, okay. I knew it was ready to go in the water. I hope I know that. 
Like he crossed his arms and everything. Oh, he surpassed it. Oh, that sound scared me. Okay. Ooh, gloves. Okay. I'm not gonna be fell down because you know you gotta see this. Maybe it's still broken. Maybe. One more to go and I'll make it across. Let me open. Something is getting in the way of that platform. Akio! That did the trick. Alright. I got my finger on Q, bro. I'm gonna play it. Because these sounds ain't. ain't this nothing. must be the way out. I need to find a way to open that gate. Incendio! Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey jukes. Okay. Oh, snap. I got okay, I gotta put my um Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Yeah, here it is. Okay. Just in case, bro, you know, we are currently stealing. Honey jukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? Revelio. the dried billywigs things now back to gareth i can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out Fuck your room. We have to like do the whole thing. I guess we do. I run back. So we got the things we needed. Alright. 
So we're, we're gonna give it to him, then we're gonna end the video. We're already like a little bit loving than usual. I guess you know, I did a lot, I've been doing a lot of main quests. So I want I want to do a full, full side. I know in the last video I did a side quest, but I want to make sure. I want to make sure I'm not doing it like how I did God of War. I, like, I was doing like mainly main quests and not really doing side quests like that. I only did side quests when the game like forced me to or urged or urged me to. So I'm gonna make sure that like, I do side quests, you know, while well, because. Well, I'm gonna probably live my life as a student. Okay, actually, no, we're gonna end it here. We're gonna, we're gonna give it to him after. Cause look, we got we, we got quests. All right, we got quests. We should do. Yeah, okay. All right, so yeah, we're we're, we're gonna end the video here, guys. We're gonna end it right here. Even if, if you enjoyed the video, please be like, subscribe if you're new, comment. I love talking, guys, in the comment section. Make sure you hit that the bell so you can know every time I upload, I upload every other day. And make sure you follow, look, go to my links in my bio for my Twitch. I actually do a stream. My Twitch, my TikTok, my Instagram. Um, I am going to try and be more consistent with my, um, with my Instagram and stuff. But, you know, we can't wait for that to come, I guess. Um, oh, God, man. This it's just this game is just it's overwhelming, bro. And it's it's a good feeling. Like it's not bad, it's a good feeling. But yeah. Well, I'll see you guys. <laughs> I can wait that long pause for no reason. But I'll see you guys when I see you guys. And don't forget to share the video. Share the video with your friend, family, shit, share it with your grandma even. Until the next time. I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Robotic Drago. Ow! Peace.